14 years, a local family has been putting on a jack-o'-lantern display that has become a fall favorite in Topeka. KSNT News reporter Kelly Saberi found out how they do it year after year. It might not look like a lot yet, but this is just the beginning. Greg and Linda Laird will have almost 300 pumpkins on Halloween night. And we're just together with family for like four days in a row, and it's better than Thanksgiving because Thanksgiving you're together a day for like a couple of hours. Even their street is hard to access on Halloween. We, Buy we bought this house is because of the porch and how many jack lanterns we, we can put get on the porch. porch. So. <laughs> They will have up to 100 people at a time in their driveway looking at the jack-o'-lanterns. In their 14 years of this tradition, they have only been smashed once. This year, I, I really did sleep out on the porch, but nothing, nothing happened that year. Yeah. But the story is that I sleep out on the porch every night. <laughs> and we, we're appreciative of that because I think that keeps Them away. smashers away. <laughs> Their theme that year was simply Happy Halloween. Linda says they were able to spell out, oh well, with the surviving pumpkins. We're going to come home at lunch and all of our neighbors had come over and cleaned up our whole driveway and cleaned up all the pumpkins because they watch it, you know, develop and what, you know, and they like watching how it, how it becomes this huge event and so they felt bad and they cleaned up all the pumpkins for us. They even have pumpkin carving friends all over the world. So I've never carved a pumpkin before, but the Lairds are teaching me how to do it like a pro. Linda's tip for me is to start simple with this pie symbol that she's drawn on, which she recommends for beginners. And she says that when it's lit up, you won't be able to see any mistakes anyways. In Topeka, Kelly Saberi, KSNT News. And I kind of got the pun there, pumpkin pie. Get it? And I can't believe Kelly has never carved a pumpkin. How do we hire people that haven't done that? I don't know. Well, if you want to check those out, you can find the link to that on our website. You know, if you might be wondering what they do when Halloween is over with all those pumpkins, the Lairds actually recycle the pumpkins by smashing them at a pumpkin patch so the pumpkins will grow next year. Pretty cool. Well, you have a bit of more.